Hello everybody, welcome to Coco's Crochet. This is Coco and I'm Litza. Today my Crochet Society box number 39 arrived, so I thought we'd unbox it together. Coco's just had her dinner. She's going to have a little rest now because she's very full and would just like a little disco nap. So I'm gonna pop her down just for now. So a couple of weeks ago, I mentioned that my box um, was arriving and it has today. So I'm very excited that we can open it together. I'm just gonna pop my glasses on so we, you know, I'll be able to read everything properly for you. Um, for those of you who aren't familiar with Crochet Society and their subscriptions, um, which is actually uh, what led me to watch a lot of, um, of the different YouTubers that I watch at the moment, because I was watching a lot of the unboxings myself uh, over a year ago because I wanted to see what was in um, the boxes I was very curious to see if it was worth the money because you know it is money that you know you spend and when you convert your dollar to the pound as well you know you've got to take that all into account but I must say that I was very impressed every single time I saw um, the content of every box and um, for my birthday in August 2021 I decided that was going to give you know be the gift that I gave to myself. Um, we were all locked down for so long and weren't spending any money on anything anyway. So I thought, let me just give it a three month trial. And let me tell you, since then I've been hooked, <laughs> literally crochet hooked. I oh, know, very silly. Um, but um, I have enjoyed opening every single box and I haven't really made very many things from it. So I was thinking when I, you know, um, opened the last box and now that this one's arrived as well, I thought, you know, I must really make an effort to actually make something from each and every box. I did make something from the very first box that I got because I was so excited. It's actually that little basket over there. I'm not sure if you can all see it, but it was from the very first box that I purchased um, about oh, a year and a half ago or so now. But since then, I've admired all the patterns and have made many plans to, you know, pick and choose and make, you know, as many as I could, but I haven't done so as that. So that might be something that I should start in 2023, a commitment to making at least one project from each box as you get three in each one. Anyway, we'll have that conversation at a later date. Let's get on with the unboxing now. So this is, hasn't even been opened yet. So I am gonna open it with um, you all together. Um, just for those who, of you who are curious though, I paid in Australian dollars for a six month subscription, $195, which equates to like a dollar a day. So I think that that's pretty reasonable. Let me just get my scissors. So I will just open it up for us so we can get into it as quickly as we can. <laughs> A bit of crinkle never hurt anybody so let me pop that on the floor now the one thing that everybody enjoys oh what a beautiful box this one is looks like there's presents christmas themed i'm guessing so it is number box number 39 in time for christmas let's hear that Oh, that Velcro sound that everybody loves that is nice and fresh and just opened. It says in here, oh, look, there's an Eiffel Tower in there and some gifts. Oh, and that's a beautiful little snow globe. So bonjour, everybody in Gayfury. How wonderful is that? I personally have been to the Eiffel Tower. I was very, very lucky. And that was one of the things on, you know, my bucket list. So, oh, it's just beautiful. Now, it does come beautifully wrapped in this tissue paper, which I don't like to break the seal. So I'm just going to very carefully um, pop everything out and tip it in to the box. So I can keep the little... Um, packaging as it is I know I know I have issues but I just love everything about um, crochet society that it's such beautiful quality oh so this is what you get inside wow look at all that yarn that is unbelievable there are two four six eight balls of yarn so we've got two so they're all confection DK and it's the Bella Coco brand 
and that you can only buy this for the um in the boxes and it says that is a dk and they're 50 gram balls these ones are in the color earl gray so you get two in the earl gray the lighting is a bit much but you get the idea there's two of those and then you get two of these and they are let's have a little look fudge so the color is fudge there that's better and then we get two of this one and this one is in the color icing sugar pretty cool and then we get one in this color and this one is fondant fancy beautiful pink and then we have this lovely color and this one is bubble gum okay i would have related the pink one to bubble gum but hey to each their own i guess you do get green chewing gum over here but Bubble gum, not so much, but nevertheless, the colours are beautiful. So these are the colours that you get. So we've got a mix. Two, four, five colours. Perfect. And in total, set two, four, six, seven balls, it looks like. Wow, that's pretty impressive. I'm just wondering what we're going to make with all of these. So, um, ever since um, I got the box originally, it was one per month. But for the last couple of um, uh, boxes, it's been every two months. So, they, they've they tried to up, you know, the little um, accessories that you get with it as well. And, you know, the little gifts other than the yarn. So, let's have a little look and see what's in here. It is a little envelope. And inside this little tiny envelope is, drum roll please, let's have a little look, what's in here? Oh, there's some black thread. So maybe we just need to do a little bit of embroidery or something, maybe some amigurumi. Oh, but there's no stuffing, so usually we get stuffing with amigurumi. So there's that. Oh, this is beautiful. Now this is a lovely stitch marker. Can you see that? Lovely, beautiful. And we always get a crochet hook. This one is a three and a half millimeter. They're the polymer clay ones. I personally believe these are better suited to the people that um, hold their hook like this, like a knife. Um, I personally hold mine like a pencil grip, but that's okay. They're actually beautiful and I do enjoy collecting them. So that's lovely. And we get, whoops, I'll just pop that box down for a moment. We also got this little, it's got a little handle on it, a little bag. It smells very new. I'm guessing it's like a little notions pouch. Beautiful addition to, you know, um, a little project bag with a few little um, accessories in there, like stitch markers, I'm guessing, and a pair of scissors, a darning needle. So that's gorgeous can't complain about that and with every single box you get oops this uh a little book so in here you will find three patterns we'll quickly flick through it and what i love about it too at the back because remember this is comes all the way from um, the uk so it's in um uk terminology but they do show you the equivalent in you know us terms as well and the great thing about every single pattern is here is that you get a video tutorial as well. So there is a code that you um, go into when, and then you type in and then you can access the video tutorials for each and every pattern. So this is Bella Coco um, with her little welcome note. She has one every single in every single box. And then there is a contents page, pages, I beg your pardon. And then we have, um, there's always an interview with a maker. This one is Tommy Adams. So he's been very busy with his amigurumi by the looks of it. So that would be very interesting to see his uh, makes. Oh, and here we go. 
one of the makes is a holiday hippo so you get the opportunity to make this at little amigurumi i won't show you the pattern obviously that can be off camera but there he is in paris <laughs> and he just shows more of the pattern and then you get to the pages where it shows you what's inside the box lovely the hook and stitch marker set gorgeous and it gives you an indication of what the price is for each one so you get a gauge on what you know the value in the box um it's saying here that the yarn is so this month's box we've got goodies for you worth over 40 pounds so that's quite a bit um of a saving there by just getting the box and this is a wonderful um idea that they have as well for people that want to make more than one project and you obviously wouldn't be able to um, with the amount of yarn that they give you you can purchase similar yarn and they give you ideas of which ones they are so you know there's like a rico in um uh Rico, it says creative, and then there's a ship she's. I can't say that word, but you um, know which one I mean. There's the Sadar. So there's a variety of different yarns. And if you can't find those particular yarns in the country that you live in either or don't want to buy online, I'm sure that we could, you know, Google it and find out the equivalent in our, you know, home. Now, this one is, oh, wow, that's a little bit, it says here, and uh, fancy filet. Gillette. I'm guessing it's like a little, it's like a little, very like a cardi or a vest almost, but not quite a vest. It looks beautiful. Oh, there it is. It's like a little bolero almost. Mm, not that short. Oops. It's very pretty though. And there's another photo of her in it. So gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. So that's already, we're at two makes. Oh, a wonderful. Look at this, free Christmas crochet patterns. And it just has some sights on there. Oh, and the last thing that you can make is this bunting. Peace on Earth bunting. How beautiful is that? And then it goes on to show you the pattern in there, how to make it. Oh, wow, and it gives you, a lot of people like to work with charts. So there you go. It gives you the charts as well for all the different numbers, uh, numbers, letters. And then there's uh, an opportunity for all of us to send in our makes. So this is, you know, people in the past, what they've made um, from previous boxes. And they always do um, encourage you to tag not only Crochet Society, but also all the makers so that they can see what, you know, what you've been making as well and then last but not least is just a little bit of an ad and that's pretty much um what comes in the um subscription boxes always very lovely and um sturdy boxes and there it is in there where it says don't forget to share your makes hashtag crochet society i haven't done that as yet but you know if i actually make some <laughs> um of the beautiful projects and there have been so many that i wanted to attempt that that would be um something that i would like to do just for fun you never know where that will take you but i will just tell you very quickly before i go with this um um subscription that i took out for the next six months they had a great offer at the time where if you purchased um the subscription for x amount of time i think three months or more you got a free pass box and you got to choose um which one you wanted and i chose box number 33 that one actually came pretty much you know in a couple of weeks because we had to wait for box number 39 to be released so i'll just show you that one very quickly i do have duplicate of it now and I purchased this one because, and here it is here, because I really, um, there we go, I really liked the original one and it says in here, make your own magic. I love it. So I won't go into great detail with this one, but I will show you the yarn that it came with. Let me just pop everything out. This is beautiful, beautiful yarn. So I thought if I had a little bit more of this, how gorgeous is that? 
so this one is a it says preserve Aaron so it's an hour they're both Aaron weight I just love the combination of these two colors together uh, this one says oh it doesn't have a color these just have numbers so we won't what you know bother with that right now but it also did come with a few other little bits and bobs in there as well which I thought I'd really like some more of them so it came with this mug which is um, a tin one crochet wizard gorgeous and this beautiful hook how beautiful is this one let me just show you up close oops sorry <laughs> here it is it's a four and a half millimeter how beautiful is that one I really like the navy. I'm a big fan of that. So that was just, you know, a real bonus to get a, another box, you know, just by subscribing, which I would have done anyway. But, you know, what a great incentive for people that, you know, haven't um, bought any as yet and were considering it just like I was at one stage. So thank you so much for joining me. I hope you enjoyed that unboxing. For those of you, you know, that are considering it, I would certainly highly recommend it. I not affiliated in any way but I certainly do enjoy um, you know every time I've unboxed them enjoy everything that's in there and you know look forward to them coming so um, thank you for joining me once again um, I hope that you're all well and you know you're getting some crochet time in as always be kind to yourself and to each other and Coco and I will see you again in another video take care everyone bye bye